Almost 500 people gathered at the Royal Bath Hotel on Saturday to support Help for Heroes and the Wessex Variety Club. The evening kicked off with a champagne reception and the attendants enjoyed the light refreshments and light entertainment. Soon, the party moved to a private suite at the Pavilion Theatre. The guests were led there in spectacular fashion, holding out traffic on Bath Road as they went. As the attendants took their seats, it was clear this evening was going to be special. The silent auction contained signed photos, shoes and rackets from some of the greatest sportsmen in the world. The three-course meal was interspersed with speeches, followed by a seemingly impromptu performance by three opera singing waiters. A public auction followed, and the crowd was soon bidding more than £3,000 for 10 days in the Barbados Villa and VIP visits to the Red Arrows base, as well as original works by local artist Johanna Lawrence. Childline founder Esther Ranson and Coronation Street actress Deborah Stevenson were both guests of honour. The charity that I have a lot of contact with is the Variety Club, because they supported Childline from the moment we were launched, and um, they do such wonderful work for disabled and disadvantaged children, so I think they're fantastic. But of course I enormously admire Help the Heroes as well, so Absolutely. couldn't be better. As for Bournemouth Mayor Barry Goldbart, he seemed to enjoy himself as well. The causes are really worth it, so uh, people will dig quite deep in their pockets. They already have in buying the ticket for this evening. Quite expensive. Yes, indeed. Yes. So it's great to see over 500 people there. Yes. Before the dancing kicked off, the raffle was drawn. The highlight was the parents of a wounded soldier winning a brand new Mazda, having spent one pound on their ticket. It feels fantastic, and it's a Mazda as well. It's brilliant. My son's actually just bought a Mazda, and it's a fantastic car. It's just amazing. Tickets for the event were eighty-five pounds. The total amount of money raised is not yet known. But the figure, to be split between Help for Heroes and the Wessex Variety Club, is believed to be in excess of £50,000. Michael Dyers for the Daily Echo, Bournemouth.